Hi, my name is Lourdes Miranda. I live in Herndon, Virginia. I'm originally from Utica, New York. Um, so, Thanksgiving dinner starts with, um, we were all out of school. Growing up, we never had turkey. So when we went to school and kids talked about what they had for Thanksgiving, they discussed turkey. My sister and I looked at each other, my brothers looked at each other, like, no, we had fenil, which is lechon, which is a roast pork. Um, we had em empanadillas, empanadas we made. We made arroz con gandules, um, also white rice with pork. A lot of pork in the family. I don't know if that's a Puerto Rican thing or not, but there was a lot of pork involved. Um, we had sorullos con bacalao. Fish was big in my family. Um, sorullos are fried cornbread, but they roll it up, roll it up, look like Cuban cigars, and it's always made with bacalao, um, a codfish. Um, Acapurias, which is very difficult to make. We also made pasteles, which is um, the Puerto Rican version of a tamale, which was very time consuming. Making pasteles is a big holiday dish, even in Puerto Rico. Platanos, plantains, were big in the family. Those were considered appetizers. Octopus is very big in Thanksgiving family. An octopus, we, they don't fry it. They actually use it as an appetizer. They saute it, cut it up, and put um, olive oil on it, and it's used like an appetizer. Dessert, flan. We never no had- pumpkin pie? Huh, no way. You know, to this day, my family does not eat pumpkin pie. There was no pumpkin pie, no apple pie, no pies. We had flan and a lot of coconut desserts. Today, same tradition, um, but they obviously assimilated, and there's always a little turkey on the side and a little chicken on the side. There was turkey, but it was never touched. We all went for the, the Puerto Rican food, and I did too. I mean, you can have turkey and chicken anywhere. It started with my brother brought his girlfriend from college home, and she was from Michigan. That's where it started. Why was it important to your family to celebrate Thanksgiving? I never asked that question, but I'm assuming they just adopted an American holiday.